Charlie Bonding here with UCCS Athletics, here with head coach Jeff Culver after the win against MSU Denver, 82-92. First off, coach, comments on the game. Great win for us, you know. Um, critical win. Uh, we wanted to treat this game like a playoff game, and and our approach was, was good. And coming off a rough road trip as far as a lot of travel and a short turnaround, and and uh, I thought our guys responded very well and, and certainly started the game very well. And, and uh, we knew Metro would not go away easily in the second half. They proved that as much and had a nice run. And I thought our guys showed great resiliency to combat that and, and get back in control of the game and make the free throws and make the shots and make the defensive stops when we needed down the stretch. So great team win. And for MSU Denver, before this game, we talked about Andre Harris coming into this game, uh, one of the most dominant players in the RMAC in the post, but you guys limited him 12 points, nine rebounds, also fouled out early in the second half. How big was that and really what worked against him? Yeah, that was huge. I mean, we wanted to double him uh, early and often, and I thought that helped quite a bit. Um, you know, he's a good player. He's going to get his, and he was he, he's so strong on the glass, and, and he was able to get some good putbacks. and. They involve him in a lot of ball screens, and, and uh, that can get tricky at times. And uh, But yeah, I thought it was a good team effort. Um, Coach Snyder had our bigs rotating uh, at a good pace and and uh, just sending a lot of different looks at them, you know, and uh, keeping fresh legs on them. And, and uh, we thought that was going to be a big key, and, and I think that did eventually help out. And we talked about uh, a little bit of an odd Tuesday game. And you said before this, we're going to treat it like a playoff game. And for sure, it felt like some playoff atmosphere in there. The crowd came out, really a, a close game down to the wire. But really, what was that like? And how was that playoff atmosphere for the team? Well, and any time we play Metro, it's going to be like a playoff game, regardless of where we play and where we win. So um, we knew they we'd, we'd have that extra factor as well. And, and uh, the crowd was great. Um, we were a little worried because, you know, everyone's excited about blackout night on Friday and we're excited about seeing that, that gym packed on Friday. But we wanted to make sure, you know, guys got a good uh, uh, opportunity to show off uh, during the weekday. And I, and I thought, uh, you know, the student section was great and nice and rowdy and, and a nice study break, you know, during the week for them. So, um, yeah, great, great environment in Gallagher and, and hopefully we can move forward and, and have a good crowd again on Friday and, and uh hopefully keep up with that same intensity that we played with today. And in the first half, MSU Denver really had trouble to start uh, getting things going, was really not shooting from uh, the best percentage from the field, but got to the free throw line six times, and Andre Harris a big part of that. But really, what was working defensively all game, but mainly in that first half? Yeah, I thought we had a pretty good defensive game plan. I thought our guys were dialed in. Uh, there was good communication. Um, we didn't have many breakdowns, you know, and, and I thought, you know, 32 for them, their freshman came off the bench and did some really good things there for a while with some high ball screen that hurt us. And he's just so good attacking the basket and we had to adjust a few things. But I thought our guys were resilient and, and uh, rode that out. But yeah, you're right. Defensively, um, we put together a good game, you know, and, and they certainly made some shots and made their runs. But I thought uh, on the defensive side of the ball, that was really a big difference for us tonight. And just taking this momentum, how do you guys carry it into blackout night against Westminster? And really, what do you guys work on for the next couple of days? A little bit of everything. You know, we'll take a day off tomorrow and get some rest and, uh, um, you know, maybe just get some shots up and, and, and try to refocus. It's tight turn again here now. So luckily, we're at home, uh, but Westminster's so good. I mean, uh, uh, you know, their only losses are to one, two, and three in our conference, and, and uh, they played each of them tight. So uh, we got our work cut out for them. They're, they're so good defensively. They're just a tough uh, physical team, and, and uh, they got good players at all positions. And so uh, we'll hit the film here in these next couple of days and get the guys ready, get get rested so that we're ready to go. And and uh, again, being at home is a big uh, advantage for us and, and uh, not having to travel on a tight turnaround. And again, hopefully the crowd comes out big and that was a huge factor for us tonight. And coach, last question, like you said, just coming off a turnaround off the road trip, but uh, after that loss against Colorado Mesa, really did the players come out and just really want to focus? It seemed like a lot of energy came from that first couple of minutes. Yeah, I mean, you win and you play such a good game tonight, and then you're kicking yourself that much more for dropping a close one last Saturday. But, you know, we can't go backwards in time, and always our focus is on the next game in front of us. And I thought our guys did a good job of putting uh, Saturday night's game behind us, using it, you know, to fuel the fire. And, and yes, I do believe that, 
um, you know, there's a number of things that got us motivated for this game. Uh, primarily, it's just the next game in front of us. But, but anytime you lose a close one on the road, uh, you're hungry to play again. So that was the one advantage, I think, of a tight turnaround where we didn't have to wait, you know. Well, there you have it. Head coach Jeff Culver of your UCSS men's basketball team after the win against MSU Denver 82-92. Coach, great game. Thank you.